This is a polynomial function question and it's based on the Leibniz-Cert uh, higher level course. It involves a quadratic function and linear factors. Um, we know that area is length multiplied by width. So if we knew the length and the area, we could find the width by dividing the area by the length. So that's what we'll do. We're going to use the array method for this. So we're going to use this quadratic grid. On top of it, we're going to place the given 2x plus 3 factor. We're going to place the area inside this. The 2x squared goes in the top left hand side. We know this because we've multiplied out a few of them. And then the plus 6 will go in the bottom right hand corner. And now we're ready to do some division. What would we multiply 2x by to get 2x squared? It's x. Or what would we multiply 3 by to get 6? It's plus 2. So this is our solution, but we might multiply out the rest of the grid to see that we get 7x, which is what was given to us. So we can see that this is correct. So the width then is x plus 2, and it's in centimeters. Now part b is to find an expression for the perimeter. We know the perimeter is if you add up all four sides of the given uh, rectangle. And um, this would mean just two lengths and two widths. So we're going to multiply two by the length and two by the width and add these together. And we simplify this expression, we see we get six X plus 10. Again, this is in centimeters. And part C, we're looking for the minimum value of x. What we do know is that the, neither the width nor the length can be negative. They must both be positive. So if the length was positive, greater than 0, this would give us that 2x is greater than negative 3, and that x is greater than negative 3 over 2, which is negative 1.5. And if the width was positive, this would give us that x is bigger than negative 2. Now, the, the bigger of these numbers is the negative 3 over 2. So this is the minimum value that x could have.